As cases of COVID-19 continue to climb, the CDC advising against travel this weekend if you are not fully vaccinated. As medical reporter Liz Bonus explains that message, getting support from one young woman on a long journey to recovery. Hey there, hello to you. She is just 23 years old and after recent travels said she came back and noticed she sort of had the sniffles. Now this young woman learning to walk and regain her balance once again after weeks of being sick with COVID-19. And I was on the ventilator for 22 days. That 22 days in intensive care turned into nearly a month long stay in the hospital for Kara Overstake. This video provided by Ohio's Mercy Health Physical Therapy team shows she is finally able to be up and moving again. Like I never would have thought that I would have to go through like a full rehab to like relearn how to walk, relearn how to like do things to like bend my knees, bend over and pick something up off the floor. Kara and physical therapist Matt Metzger spoke to us from one of those rehab sessions. Uh, I heard from one doctor uh, say that they've seen um, for every week that somebody's sick, it's you're looking at about a month of recovery. Kara says with every struggle to take a step, she is reminded that she should not have delayed getting a COVID-19 vaccine. I just kind of had it like just kept pushing it back just because of how busy I was. And then I just never had time to get it. And I should have gotten it earlier than now. So what is it now that you want us to share? You really need to think about what you're doing, how much you're traveling, where you're traveling to and like taking the precautions that you need to. But also if you're not vaccinated, like I would say get the vaccine at this point because it's just getting worse if you're not vaccinated. She is expected to make a full recovery, but her therapy team admits it's going to take some time. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Now back to you. From